Brachial plexus it is a plexus of nerves formed by the anterior rami of lower four cervical and the first thoracic spinal nerves with little contribution from the C4 to T2 spinal nerves. Components it has four components roots, trunks, divisions, and cords. Roots is basically from C5, C6, C7, C8, and T1, and they are deep to the scalenus anterior muscle. Trunks or C5, C6 unite to form the upper trunk, C7 alone form the middle trunk, and the C8 and T1 unite to form the lower trunk. Divisions each trunk will be divided into anterior and posterior division. Cords anterior divisions of the upper and middle trunk unite to form the lateral cord, and the anterior division of the lower trunk unite as the medial cord and the posterior divisions of all three trunks unite to form the posterior cord. Branches of the brachial plexus uh, from roots uh, there will be two branches one is a long thoracic nerve to serratus anterior muscle its root value is C5, C6 and C7 and dorsus capillary nerve its root value is C5. And from trunks, uh, from upper trunk, uh, suprascapular nerve, C5 and C6, and nerve to subclavius, C5 and C6. From division, there are no branches. And from cords, from lateral cord, three branches, lateral pectoral nerve, C5, C6 and C7, lateral root of median nerve, C5, C6 and C7, musculocutaneous nerve, C5, C6 and C7. From the medial cord, medial pectoral nerve, C8 and T1, Medial cutaneous nerve of the arm C8 and T1, medial cutaneous nerve of the forearm C8 and T1, and medial root of the median nerve, and ulnar nerve. Its root value is C7, C8, and T1. From the posterior cord, radial nerve C, uh, C5 to T1, axillary nerve C5 and C6, thoracodorsal or the la nerve to latissimus dorsi. Its root value is C6, C7, and C8. And upper scapular, sorry, upper subscapular nerve C5 and C6, and lower subscapular nerve C5 and C6. Clinical aspect uh, first, we will be discussing the ALBS point. It is the region of the upper trunk of the brachial plexus where six nerves meet as follows fifth and sixth cervical root join to form the upper trunk, and it gives off two nerves what is the suprascapular nerve and nerve to subclavius. And this region is known as the ALBS point. Herbs paralysis, it is mainly caused due to the excessive increase in the angle between the head and the shoulder and it forms a deformity, typical deformity called the policeman's tip hand or so in this deformity the arm is adducted, medially rotated and the forearm is extended and pronated and there will be loss of sensation along the outer aspect of the arm then the clump is paralysis, it involves C8 and D1 and uh, it mainly causes it due to the hyperabduction of the arm. Clinical feature client loss of sensation along the medial border of forearm and hand, and the Horner syndrome.